Hi everybody, Keith Smyre here with the Epiphone Casino Revolution John Lennon Limited Edition. <laughs> casino as well. Casino was introduced by Epiphone in 1961, called the E230 TD model. It's essentially a thin line guitar, hollow body. Paul McCartney was the first Beatle to acquire Epiphone Casino. He was followed by George and John. John got his one in 1966. It was a 1965 Sunburst model. You can hear Paul's Casino on the lead guitar playing on Ticket to Ride. Drive My Car and Taxman. Around 1968, the time of the White Album, John removed the finish from his guitar, also the pick guard. In 1997, a team from Epiphone visited the Dakota and made accurate measurements of John's original instrument. Epiphone have released 1,965 of these Revolution guitars. That's the sanded down version with the John modifications on it. Here's the label inside the F hole. Epiphone have really done their homework and have installed a 17 degree neck angle on this model, not the usual 14 degree. The guitar comes with a nice selection of paperwork, including a certificate. There's even a spare black control knob, so you can change one of your control knobs for a black one, just like John did. I think Epiphone have done a really good job of recreating John's Kalamazoo bodied Epiphone Casino.